We've got a second and 11. Ball on their own 48. The Gators come out with two tight ends. The quarterback is in the shotgun. They go with the option. The seven yard run by the running back. There was some movement along the line. Let's get the call. There's a chip by the linebacker. They'll throw on first down. Fires across the middle. Number 36 intercepts it. What an interception by the cornerback. I love it. A defensive back with soft hands. This kid can play. Number 22 lines up in the deep back. Eye formation. He looks to throw on first down. Looking. Complete. He's hit and taken down. A decent gain on the pass. Yo, Kirk, good job by the quarterback here reading this play. Yeah, the defense came with a blitz, and you're right. Great job. He comes to the line, only one man in the backfield. Play action. Steps up. Throws it deep downfield. And got him! They made that touchdown look really, really easy, Coach. And that's what you get when you practice hard all week long. Practice makes perfect, my friend. And that was as close to perfect as you will get. Line up for the extra point. Tennessee up six. Kicks away. And he tacks on the extra point. And now we're going to take a look at the Pontiac drive summary. Lines up for the kickoff. He kicks off. Gathered in at the six. And down he goes at the 29-yard line. The offense comes out to start this drive, and they're hoping for a better result. As they need to get in the rhythm. Kirk, you say kickers are head cases. Well, I say quarterbacks are head cases. What? No, they're not. Oh, yeah? Watch. If this quarterback throws an interception here, then he'll finish the game with six of them. If he doesn't get pulled first. The quarterback showed pass for a second, then handed it to the back, and he was able to get 10 yards on the carry. Second and inches. They're in the shotgun with three wide receivers. Has it to the senior. I'll tell you, this receiver showed really good hands on that play.